So yeah, so that is the canteen just now. And yeah, it actually looks quite good today. Maybe because it's sunny, the footage actually looks quite good. The color, I really like it here. So yeah, oh, they have this new thing. This is the rooftop. After you're studying, you need some refreshing or you need to take a call, you can come up here. And yeah, let me just quickly show you a bit. So there's actually one more study room here inside there. Uh, it's, it's, the, it's the same, la, the, the format is the same. It's similar to the study, but I kind of like the study as you can see. You have more views there. The, the views are better because you get to see Yutan Green. The ambience is nicer there, at least for me. And this is also uh, what is called Ian and Peony Ferguson study. So yeah, some people prefer here, some people prefer the study, some people prefer other places. I personally like the study, but this is not bad as well. The, the setting is quite similar, the table and design, so I won't enter anymore. But here, we have the rooftop. So there is actually a rooftop, so, but I've never gone up to that part. So yeah, apparently, I guess we can climb out until that places, but I don't think anyone ever Neither do I. Our oh, infinity pool. So yeah, there's our U-Town residence. Alright. Okay, so I guess that should be it. Uh, yes, actually there's a bit of place I can show you guys also like, downstairs. Uh, I think we were on the level 2, right? I'll show you guys the level 2, the canteen, the gym. But I never gone down to the level one yet. But basically, things are quite similar on level one. You have our international student office. Eh, sorry, not international student office. It's admission office there. So if you guys, yeah, especially for you guys who just wanted to study at NUS, you want to do, you have some admission matter. Our admission office is there at Utown, and then I think we also have a souvenir store there. It's actually a bookstore or NUS Corp. I can't remember. But you can buy some souvenir there if you want to buy NUS t-shirt and stuff like that. I believe they still open the store. Not sure during COVID, but there's also a store on level one. You also have some uh, cafe there. You have uh, a bank ATM on level one, and then entrance to the auditorium too as well. And then, oh, it's super hot here. Let me just walk inside. And then inside there, what 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 else do you have? Ah. Uh? Uh, oh yeah, we also have some dance studio. Actually, besides that, besides that, right, we also have our sports hall as well, dance studio and sports hall. You see, so behind there, uh, so under the building, then behind it, the, so under the swimming pool, that is our admission office, and across the admission office, those our sports hall as well. We have Yudan Sports Hall there, and our dance studio is also there on level one. So yeah. That should be it for you town. Um, this is just a quick vlog, obviously not a very comprehensive one. Uh, as you can see here, oh, I can actually show you guys a bit for the residential college. Let me just show you quickly from the rooftop. I forgot. Uh, let's go quickly here. It's actually a nice place here to shoot the vlog. Okay, so like I mentioned just now, we got Tembusu here, so this is Tembusu Residential College. This is Tembusu. Then, if I'm not mistaken, that's CAP, CAPD, our CAP Residential College, and that is RC4. So yeah, if you guys are interested to staying on campus and you guys are curious about Residential College, so these are a couple of options we have at Utown. You guys can just check out the website directly on how the rooms look like. They actually have the picture. I've never been to CAP. I've been to CAP actually, but only the only the meeting room, like the meeting room, not exactly uh, the bedroom. So I'm not sure inside how is it. But usually, the picture you can you can find the picture already on their website. If I'm not mistaken, they should have it, or at NUS website you should be able to find it as well. In fact, they have like the 360 picture for you to check out the room. So that's CAP. This is the Busu, and that's RC4. Yeah, I've actually been there only for meetings, 
including Tembusu as well and that's UTR I actually been to my French room last time at Yutong residence if you guys can check out the vlog of my first Yutong vlog it was in Bahasa though but if you guys are curious about the room you guys can just check out my second part of my Bahasa Yutong vlog then you will be able to see uh, how the rooms look like in reality now. So that's that and that is our NUS Yale College Yale NUS College building It used to be called Yale NUS uh, right now they changed it already So yeah, next time is second they changed to NUS College If I'm not mistaken But yeah that's that So I guess that should be about it Oh my hand is trembling Luckily I'm using gimbal I guess my hands is too tired already Alright so Let's do the closing Alright, uh, so thanks a lot for watching until the end of this video. I think my explanation is very terrible, still very terrible right now. I hope you guys can still understand and still find this video useful. I hope that my English explanation can be much better as we go, as we do more videos. And yeah, this is NUS. I hope I have shown you guys a bit here. Likely, I won't be doing more vlogs about NUS. Maybe if... This is my last semester already. Let me just talk a bit. This is my last semester already. I'm graduating this semester. A mixed feeling. Part of me is happy. Part of me is like a bit upset as well. I've been spending my last three and a half years here. It's been quite a journey. And yeah, I don't think I'll do another vlog again at NUS. Maybe sometime later coming back for graduation or something. Or maybe just came back to do a quick vlog. I'm not sure. But I don't think I will do another vlog here because this semester my modules are still all online so that's why I don't need to come back to school uh, as often uh, unless I need to do something then I'll, only then I will need to come back lah. but typically I don't see myself coming back for school matters at least not soon so that's why I don't think I can do <laughs> a day in the life vlog of an offline and year student I don't think we have it later too bad it's my last semester already maybe once covid gets better maybe furious later i just ask for permission to shoot a day in the left vlog but not of my life maybe somebody else if they are willing <sighs> so we'll see how anyway thanks a lot for watching this video uh, i hope it has been entertaining actually there's one more thing uh. there's this berlin wall uh berlin wall that they put up here at Utah, but I actually never found it yet so maybe the next time around if I came back to Utah again okay, I'll go and try to, to try to find that wall and do a quick vlog so that's that thanks for watching until the end of the vlog and yeah I hope it, this vlog has been able to show you a bit on Utah, especially for prospective students uh, yeah definitely it will be a Definitely Utah is one of the places you'll visit often as a student, regardless of your faculty. And hopefully COVID uh, doesn't last that long and you guys can also visit here soon. Even though you guys are not students here, hopefully you guys can still visit here soon uh, once COVID ends. And yeah, you can just get a glimpse of how things are at NUS. Uh, Utah is actually one of the really nice places I would say, because it's newly built. And yeah, they're actually renovating a lot of buildings recently, so a lot of places are getting very nice right now but I'm graduating soon just like you know my faculty we got I think I mentioned in my last vlog my faculty we got a new building called Com3 but I'm graduating this time so I guess it's only done on like and the end of the year or like next year so can't really get to enter that building after I graduated I guess only then I can enter that building uh, but I guess that's it again I've been this is super bad habit of mine keep talking keep talking during my closing but all right let's end it here so thanks a lot for watching i hope it has been entertaining and see you guys again in the next video see ya